What's up, YouTube? Autobots are on. God, it's gonna get it take some time to get used to. Uh, it's been a little while since I've actually done a video. Um, yeah, a lot of stuff going on in my life. Uh, I've been putting way too much work on a Facebook page for Dungeons and Dragons, uh, and not enough time here. And I do apologize, but I wanted to do an unboxing video, something I haven't really done in a while. Um, hopefully, I should be able to do one on what's over here that what we're not going to get into right now maybe uh the main attraction <clears throat> is this super premium colossal figure for hero clicks galactus uh earlier this year or a couple years ago i just got my first galactus from galactic guardians um and i really wanted to get this one because this one just looks so much oh that doesn't even come out clear enough so we'll i'm mostly getting this because i have an event coming up with a couple friends that we're going to be playing for hero clicks uh for the first time in a long time fucking covid am i right so we're gonna get cracking at this i have actually no idea how this thing works surprisingly i've not watched anything on it so other than pictures and a few videos on like what it looks like and how cool it is, I have no idea how this works on the tabletop or how good it is on the tabletop. So let's dive in. Like the powers and abilities, I have no idea what this silly thing does. Oof. seen a card anywhere. Oh, there it is. So we'll put the card here. Holy cow. Okay, so there's a thing. How easily does the head just come off? easily it just they initially put it packaged it so that it doesn't that it just pops right off and the blast effect yeah that's pretty awesome <laughs> that's actually really cool um so here he is out of the box and mostly assembled i guess you could call it um the dude is huge Harold, 20 plus 25 points. Elemental converter dial. Okay. Yeah, he's a big guy. Um, I think the other Galactus I have is bigger than this. I, mean, I He's currently packed away in storage. I only kept out a handful of things like from uh like i've been picking and choosing my sets for obvious reasons but i play like super silver age so like everything's legal um but yeah i'm pretty like the upcoming event that we're doing in-house is going to be the avengers versus galactus i will be playing the part of galactus so i needed this i wanted to get the new one um yeah, I'm pretty sure the other one's actually bigger. Well, from the bottom of the base to the head, I think they're the same height. But just overall girth and everything, I think the other one's bigger. And then let's just trade out the heads. And that's what he looks like with the alternate head. Uh, it's kind of weird for me. I'm too used to him, you know, having his big pointy head. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I'm very happy that that can come in and on and off easily, mostly for the sake of storage. So there he is. There's Galactus. Let's put him to the side for a minute. And oh my god, he has one of those ridiculous cards. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Okay. Okay. 
the Herald came up. It's actually really good. Overall, based on what I'm just quick reading through this, he's extremely powerful. Yeah, so his full thousand points, he's a monster. Um, I, I don't, how does he move? Well, we'll have to, I'll have to continue reading and find out on how he moves, but... Uh, or is he another one of those Galactuses that can just shoot the field and not worry about it? But yeah, he basically can shoot the effing field and not worry about it. He is extremely gorgeous. I do love this Metallic, though. This Metallic actually does pick up really well on camera. All right, so Autobots Aaron, Galactus. And I'll see you guys, uh, hopefully, with a uh, nautical adventure for a video here soon. Have a good one.